Clash games and then pretty much logged off after that this weekend. So that's like a good example, right? If you're interested in the stream schedule, which doesn't actually exist, just join my Discord right here. Uh, I post every time that I'm going live and try to keep you updated if like the ch if a schedule change happens, right? Uh, right now I'm streaming like the afternoon, like noonish. I stream. I try to stream six hours a day. That that's pretty much at at minimum. I try to go six hours every day. Just watch your karma video. Can you recommend a pure carry build? I feel like Athene's Art Redemption is amazing, but it lacks the carry. Or maybe I'm wrong. Oh, um. So for uh, karma, I've been rushing. I've been rushing Sork shoes early, and then I usually go. Um, you can either go Ludens. You can go Ludens after Athenes, and that'll get you 40% CDR. And then you should go Oblivion Orb, Void Staff, and then finish your Morellos if you really are looking for some damage. I've done that build before, though. I like it. I like it a lot. I actually don't... Usually when I go the Athenes Sork Shoes, I usually don't get Arda and Redemption. It's, it's very rare for me to do that. Sometimes I do it, but like it's not, as, it's not that common. Thank you, JK Ray, for the 100 bits. Appreciate it. Oh, heads up. Uh, I'm sure you probably, since you have the Twitch Prime. Uh, anyone who has Twitch Prime right now, you can purchase 500 bits. You don't have to donate here. You can donate anywhere. But I recommend you should actually do it if you like donating, you know, cheering and doing donations. Uh, it's 99 cents for 500 bits right now. And your broadcasters will still get the f full $5 for it. So take advantage of that uh, right now. Take advantage of it right now. Oh, also, uh, one thing to note is it's really hard for me right now to upload videos as I just recently moved my YouTube over to a brand. Uh, which is different than like my original. So I've lost my I've lost my URL. I'm trying to work on that. But I've also lost my Twitch integration for uploading VODs. So the VODs are coming out a lot slower than I want them to. I apologize for that. There's really not too much I can do about it though. Um, so I hope you bear with me. Hopefully it's not a problem for too long. Um, so yeah, like the Unranked Challenger... Um, once clash once all the clash videos are up unranked to challenger will start coming back uh, i still have a lot of videos for unranked to challenger that we'll be releasing if you miss like any of the games for full commentary and then yeah i'm trying to fix my youtube uh, fix a lot of things right now a bunch of shit just broke basically but i need to convert to a brand anyway because i need i need to be able to add editors to my youtube channel uh for highlights montages etc like things i really want to like i really want to grow the youtube a lot um so yeah, I'm starting to like get enough money from streaming that I feel like I can invest some of the money back in and start paying some people. So uh, yeah, maybe there's gonna be a lot of new content that's gonna be coming out in the next maybe like month. I'll try to reiterate this as much as I possibly can. Uh, but anyway, just wanted to say like, sorry, the videos are sluggish right now. What's stopping you and Nintendo from giving each other 25 bucks for five bucks at a time? What do you mean? It's just Twitch Prime users can buy. Oh, I mean, I could, right? If I was a Twitch Prime, he was a Twitch Prime, and we both bought the $5 thing for a dollar, we could donate to each other. There's nothing stopping you from doing that. Except for the, I'm pretty sure there's a one-time transaction fee, right? So you only get once. I've been recently playing AP Sona and Janna as support. What do you think about these picks? I My win rate is currently high, but I don't know if I can do this in higher ELO. Keep doing what works for you until you feel like it isn't working, and then adjust accordingly. I think that's fine. There's lots of champions you can play once. Uh, play well. You can only do the 500 bids once. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah. Otherwise, right, like, wouldn't, wouldn't I just tell you, hey, guys, you should just legit, legit just dump a bunch of money on that. Or wouldn't I just do it for myself too? Yeah, like I could do that for myself. Yeah. 
I don't think uh, from a business standpoint, Amazon would be too qu quite too happy with that. I think it's just, uh, you know, they're just trying to do a lot of uh, promotional stuff with the bits because they want you to be buying bits, not donating, basically, right? Because then Twitch gets the money, not PayPal. Can you explain why you picked Blitzcrank this game? Uh, I've just been winning a lot with it. You know, sometimes that's actually just the main reason why I pick a champion. Uh, you know, I've just been winning a lot on the patch with this champion. Uh, I think I've been playing the champion pretty well. I think it's relatively strong. Uh, it has some obvious issues, right? If I get, like, really far behind. But I feel like I have really good impact with this champion. So, I've been picking it a lot. When I am Smirvian, I am Smirvian Zyra. So far, 88% win rate. Nice, dude. Yeah, Zyra is, uh, Zyra is a pretty fun champion. I think there's a rule against donate it to yourself. No, but, like, you could trade donations, right? Like, if you had two people. It doesn't even matter. I don't have Amazon Prime. My sister has Amazon Prime. I wonder if she even watches on Twitch. This game's gonna be a little bit weird. I'm either gonna need like an early hook to get momentum, or I'm gonna probably have to hold out for either a gank or hit level six. But once I hit level six, I'll be in really good shape. So I'm not like too worried about it. Just take the bush right now. Just make them push, make them get pushed back. I discovered your channel this past weekend and I'm enjoying your content. Glad to have found the support, mainstream. Keep it up. Thank you. Thank you for the 500 bits. Appreciate it. Hero. Don't forget to join the Discord and check out my YouTube channel if you like my content. Alright. Uh, I can actually just walk up. I'm actually just gonna ignite him. Hmm, fuck. I didn't get his heal. I actually really wanted his heal. Yeah, he was, like, juking down the whole time. He was just running in a straight line, so it was a pretty easy hook for me to get. I wish my AD carry had committed a bit harder. I should have used the ignite immediately. I think that would have made my AD carry commit harder. You know what I mean? I have a text. I have a text I actually need to respond to. Okay. Your smurf ratios are fucking insane. Actually, they're pretty fucking bad. <laughs> they're pretty bad, actually. But I am playing by myself, and I may have not tried to win as hard as I possibly could on some of the games in my promotional games. All right, so how am I supposed to get something done right now? This is just a shitty wave. I actually need the wave on my side. Nice, we got to come in. That's super good for us. All right, well, if I'm the jungler, they paint bottom. It means that he probably routed back bottom, right? Yeah, this, like, makes me think that I'm going to get ganked. Inted. I did not int any game. I never inted a game. I just tried out jungle. Yeah, I can't risk this fucking jungler coming through lane and me over forcing on a big wave. It's just not worth it. It's better if I just chill for right now. Not getting bullied and harassed in this lane is already like a pretty big win mentally for me. <laughs> I did not have sex with that woman. No, I did not end the game though. I think it's actually okay if I hook in the blitz or the thrush. Man, this sucks. Jungler ended up backing up, and the wave's too big for me to really, like, get anything done. I don't really have any control over that, though. Dying to Jungler is, like, in my in my books, it's, it's as close to Antini as you can possibly do. 
Like, sometimes the jungle gank is good, but not here, right? Oh, I shouldn't have hit that. Fucked up his minion. Okay. I know where the jungler is now. No flash. Come here, bitch. Nice. Good pillar. Oh, wow. He actually put a pink ward down, too. Why medallion? Uh, Relic just got nerfed. Like, it doesn't make any money for you anymore. And it doesn't really give you too much combat strength anymore. So, I just always go... I always go coin now. Gives you more gold. It also... It also means that you don't have mana constraints anymore in lane. Like, I can throw out a lot more hooks and use a lot more spells because I get mana back. It's just overall better. Plus, it, um... Cheaper to finish your sidestone upgrade. Uh, gives you movement speed. Oh, yeah, please take that. I'm okay just hitting this guy. Haha, <laughs> do you see that? I walked on top of my teammate when he tanked the trap, and then he right clicked on me on accident. I think Stain's dumb. Even if I can get a kill in this lane, Stain's dumb. Uh, cool. I've already got my Moby boots. Nice. Game's going pretty well for us. I have Ignite too. Would you go coin on Alistair and Braum too? I'm not sure. I fucking don't want to play those champions ever again. Those champions are awful right now. I went coin on Alistair. It didn't feel bad, but it didn't feel good either. Oh, uh, you know what I should do? This wave isn't going to crash all the way. I'm going to fucking pop over the wall and kill this guy. Cool. I got a lot of damage on him. And I can just eat a biscuit in a pot. What I wanted to do right there is I want to keep constantly staggering her back. Like, I make her back not, not align with the Thresh. I guess we just lose that. Damn, I thought for sure we'd win a 3v3 where I collapsed on it. I guess it was an overreach by me. That's uh, pretty unfortunate. Oh, my AD carry is ending. That sucks. Hmm. You have flash. Nice. I wonder if he can just stay. I was going to get this pushed now. Try and focus on hitting level 6. I'm just putting as much damage into the ranged minions as possible. Damn, I'm one minion from 6. We're doing dragon right now, so uh, I don't think that play works. Also, feels really bad to go mid. I feel like in team fights right now, Yasuo's ability to just like channel alt into everybody is really a problem. I'm just gonna back and sell like one or two of my biscuits. That should get me my upgrade. Yeah, both of them. Fine with that. If you sell your biscuits, you still get the flat mana, so it's like actually super good. That's why I love biscuits. Yeah, my chatter's got you. You just make shit gold with relic. If if you want like a TLDR, right? You just make shit with relic gold. Damn, both of their swordmen people are crapping on my lands. Um, on a ward.
We should put a Q into this, just so it'd like push back a little bit. There we go. Your jungler is on the top side. <laughs> Pretty sure we just win. I'm gonna silence both of them and use ignite on this guy. You guys a bit tankier than you'd anticipate. Yeah, I had feeling such is down here. That's why I worried for it too. Uh, if I run into a pink, can I get rid of it? No, I can't. It's dumb. Oh, well, I only committed a trinket word to it, so it's not that big of a deal. Wow, it was actually really hard to kill that Thresh, though. Uh, that was through Ignite, and they didn't even have heal. Noted for the next fight. I think I somehow have to get... I somehow have to get Aftershock out of that guy beforehand. I'm actually down to just commit a pink to this. I'm just like basically keeping them interested in potentially my journaler being down here because I'm like pinking aggressively and stuff. That way he can just get the Rift Herald for free. Pretty dumb to move up. Can 2v2 kill them pretty easily though. Also just hit my next biscuit. He has ult up again. Jungler shouldn't be down here anymore. Oh, missed it. I don't have hook right now. I think my best bet is to use silence immediately on the Thresh. That way he can't flay. Because if I can lock him out of his um, Aftershock, he's going to take a lot more damage, a lot faster. Man, my soul is just like, can't keep it together. We picked pretty trash ass solo champions too. Leakpedia doesn't say much about you. Yeah, I never really worked with Leakpedia on that. They contacted me a bunch, but, uh... Yeah, I don't really fuck with that. Yeah. My teammate should just play through bottom, though. There's no reason for him to go anywhere else right now. Wow, there's his one. He is fucking massive. He's level 10. Actually, has two levels on my jungler. That is not how that matchup's supposed to go. Yeah, yeah. Gotcha, bitch. I wouldn't chase that. You can't go through the box. He should just use the rift. Yeah, okay, he's using it. Nice, we gotta kill top two. You're stomping? I mean, first of all, you gotta get the turret. Like, no matter no matter the circumstance... Oh my god. I did not expect that to push him out of the way, the way it did. You need to get a turret down before you can do anything. If you don't get the turret down, you just leave yourself open to losing, like, a bunch of farm and shit. That guy's dead again, 100%. Yeah. 
Uh, is this guy even gonna be killable? Like, I feel like he just walks up and goes into the race, starts dashing around there. Like, it just seems like a nightmare to get this guy. Oh, he didn't actually dash through the race. Interesting. Like, right now, we're swapping out now, but it's, like, kind of bad anyway. Basically, you're gonna lose Dragon for free. Hmm. I mean, I'm running to this guy, but it's going to be pretty hard for me to lock him down. Yeah. There's just too many dashes. Like, if I don't have some, like, if I don't have hard CC, like, standing right next to me at the time, it's, it's pretty doomed. Should just try laying this while they get the dragon. I guess it's not terrible. You don't really need more than one mountain dragon to really unlock a lot of objectives. So, I'm okay with this since we're getting a turret for it. I need to just flash out, use ignite on him. I'm just trying to deter them from going on me like super hard. I don't know if Winwall got used. I wasn't paying close enough attention. I kind of just want to pull this guy really far back. Who did we kill? We killed Caitlyn. Alright, well, at least our tri is working is like paying dividends. I really can't put a Blitzcrank cook into a wall though. That is so bad. They'll just go nuts on my teammates if I do that. I wish our Trundle was uh walking with us though. I don't know what he was doing. Okay, so we traded Dragon for a top turret. Nobody died. All positives. Enemy team is all physical damage, so we can itemize pretty easily against this. Yasuo is the Vigar you said was playing well. I see. You won't go nuts on him. Just get some control over the bottom side. I can actually just long collapse on this guy. Oh, never mind. Definitely wanna, don't want to do that on vision. Huh. I don't think I'm getting any help. We have mid lane priority, and we have the bot lane pushed out, and I get collapsed on first. That sucks. Oh, we got a kill there, I guess. Noted. Teammates are retarded. Need to play slower. I don't know how he was able to move while he threw a hook, though. That was pretty lame. Uh, is that guy not looking at his screen? Alright, he's building the Zeeks, so I guess I just won't build the Zeeks. Although he should really build like a lot greedier. Just push down mid at the same time. We actually push way, way faster than them. I can also on demand go on somebody and kill them. I have a ward down mid now, so I can move my vision. This is a game where I just build like hella greedy. I get like a straight frozen frozen heart. Dies for pink teammates are retarded. Twitch hair type something doesn't understand the full context.
Should just be able to get vision control all over here. I'm gonna sweeper through it right now. We probably actually don't have any established vision here. That's why I catch somebody. Juke. Oh, this is like such a bad spot to get caught in now. Just ignite his ass. Ah, uh, wind wall. Nice, let's go to Baron. Come, it doesn't matter. Do it. Wait for her to dash. Knock him up afterwards. Use ultimate so you can't do anything. That's the power of vision, bros. Plus that jungler doesn't do anything. Uh, How close am I to Knight's Vow? Blur, let's just complete two parts. Need my jungler to build hella greedy. I want him to like build like frozen heart, randuins. Like I want him to be so impossible to deal with. Okay, you push, I grab with. In case anyone doesn't know in chat, Baron buff increases the movement speed of your minions. So whenever this is happening, you should just grab the waves. We faster. We're faster and it's 4v5. Let's just go nuts. Keep going. They literally didn't do any damage to the minions. And they have shit wave clear. Give everyone the movement speed. Make sure I hit the silence. Alright, he's gone. And. Just make sure I use everything on that guy. That is the only strong player on their team. Got around the AD carry. Nice. Or the sub 20. Did you break up with Nintendo? No, I'm just trying to get some Smurf games in. I don't know. I've been playing on like my master's accounts and the game quality is actually just utter trash. So I'm just trying to take a break, like detox almost from my games. Uh, good job, Trundle. Detox from my games almost. Do full commentary games, right? Everyone likes the Unranked to Challenger series anyway. Uh, it gives me some YouTube content I can put up later on. Um, plus, I might actually play on this account when I get it, like, a higher and higher ELO. 